Hello, pussy poppers. We're here with Supple, episode one. You're going to be blown away. You're going to be blown the fuck away. This game has shade, sex, and promotions via sex. It's going to be fabulous. Welcome to Supple, episode one, the promotion. You play Aaron Costello, associate editor at Supple Magazine. Your goal, beat your self-centered but sexy colleague Hugh for the promotion of style editor. To succeed, raise Aaron's game performance meter to the green. How do you do that? Use your life experience and savvy. Interact, talk, do a little schmoozing or insulting if necessary. Drink coffee and eat snacks to keep your energy up. Earn money by working. Use that money to buy clothing and impress your boss, Margot. Have fun. Associate editor here at Supple, the magazine for single urban professional women. Which is a good thing, since I am one. Someday I'll run this magazine, but for now I'll settle for the style editor position that just opened up. All I have to do is convince my boss Margot to promote me instead of that lunkhead Hugh. Sure, he's a cute lunkhead, but that doesn't mean he should be style editor. That job is all mm. mine. Just let him try to get it from me. Ha! Mm. Damn. I'm Margot Winterbottom, editor-in-chief here at Supple. I'm also a former model and former wife of Ryan Winterbottom III, a trust fund baby who snapped at the age of 42 and left me and our precious puppy Coco to run off to India and herd sacred cows. Idiot. Anyway, all I care about is making Supple the hottest magazine in circulation. But I just had to get rid of our style editor, which means I have to choose between these two stunning specimens, Aaron and Hugh, to take over. It'll be a hoot to see what they do to win me over. Well, let the games begin. I will fuck you. I understand you haven't had your husband left you. You may be lonely. We will fuck you. Hey, I'm Hugh Chadwick, AKA Houston. I'm an associate editor at Supple, and I love my job. Loser! How could I not? I'll I'm the still only fuck man you though. in an office full of single women, <laughs> like a kid in a candy store. Plus, hey, I'm a well put together guy, if I do say so. In fact, I'm angling for this new style editor position here. I just have to get my boss, Margot, to promote me and not Aaron. I mean, I like Aaron. She's hot. And she's pretty nice, too. But can she <gasps> really that? handle the power of being style editor? <laughs> I don't think so. That job is just screaming, Hugh Chadwick, take me. If I was married to her, I'd run off to take care of sacred cows, too. Oh, oh, we would all run off to take care of sacred cows. Cows are kind of cool people, so easy. Hey, how was your spin class last night? My spin class? Be touchy, ignore you, be friendly. Ooh. Oh, the instructor played Bon Jovi and put the strobe lights on. I nearly had an epileptic seizure on the bike. <laughs> Poor Aaron. Hey, next time that happens, just close your eyes and pretend you're in a nightclub on a bike. Which would never happen. Never mind. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh... There's no better way to cool down this what? summer than with a delicious thirst quenching <laughs> Polar Pop cup from Circle K. Shut up. Polar Pop, Pussy Pop. Just pretend you're riding your bike in the club. You won some perks. As you play supple, win perks in four categories. Hit perks button to see your current scores. Beat your best if you can. Okay. I'm gonna get a cup of coffee. He was touchy too. Oh wait, wait for me. Dumb noise. Oh, bent over right in front of me, Hugh. Hell yes. I will peg that ass so hard. It's on, this is on a completely- okay, here's my entry in today's stupidest noise game. <laughs> oh, no way. Check this out. Sorry, sucker. <laughs> what? <laughs> this is the sound of me sucking your dick. <laughs> what did she just do? <laughs> this game is wild so far, actually. Get her new clothes now. Need cash? Click monitor near plant on her desk to work and earn money. So you're saying you can't even, like, buy clothes really quick? What am I doing? 
I have to work. Yeah, get to fucking work. <gasps> this is our closet. It's a nice closet, but holy shit. We spent all the money on the closet and nothing on the clothes. <laughs> Shop till you drop. Click on clothes. You must first examine, then you can buy if Aaron can afford it. All right, so I'm guessing I can't afford anything then. What's that? Oh, there she is. God, 10 years later, get in the fucking store, Aaron. We are waiting on you. Romantic effect. Very strong. Wait, how? where's my money? I have $170. Girl, you can't shop designer yet. You don't have the money for that. You only got 150 though. Oh, I see. Okay, there's our little... Takes her a while to do things. Her boobs are fat. We do have nice fat tits. Whoa. Oh, shit. Those really accentuate our fat tits. How much is that? Five seventy five. What about this cheap shit over here? They're all jeans. Uh, help is here if you need detailed help. All right, we get it. All right. Um, I should actually probably wait. The bar. Oh well, I can't afford the fucking clothing, but I can afford a martini. Complain about you, about Margo, about work. Let's go complain at the bar about our work and then drink. You're so fucking confused. We're all very confused. <laughs> oh my god. The elevator in our building takes so long. It's like by the time I get to the office, my outfit's a season old. No. There's no better way no! to down this summer oh, than please. with a I want to enjoy this game so bad, but fucking Polar Pop, dude. No, it's every fucking five minutes with this shit. That guy did not give a fuck. Get advice from him. Ladies, never let anyone make you feel like your worth is directly proportional to your tan line. To your, did he say tan line? Whatever. Don't make anyone ever feel like your worth is proportional to your fat tits, okay? That's what he said. I want a martini now. Oh, there's look at my cute little martini. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> that big ass glass, bigger than her face. <laughs> All right, all right, we get the help button, I understand. All right, let's go, we need to go back to the office, actually. <gasps> Wait, he doesn't have jeans on. Ooh, let's talk shit about our boss. Um, I'm trying to talk to you, can you stop working? I'm trying to talk shit about our boss. Now stop working. Marco dresses like the aging fashion model she is. <laughs> aging fashion model? Like a Christy Brinkley, for example? Erin, have you seen Christy Brinkley lately? She's looking and dressing just fine, toots. Toots! He called me toots! Given, stand firm. Damn. If Marco didn't drink her breakfast every morning, she might look as good as Christy Brinkley. Did my boss hear me talking shit about if she did it? Oh my god. Ciao. Wait, let's go suck up to the boss. Stay supple. Stay supple. What? Slap him with our feminist tits? Yeah, we should. Call me toots. How dare you? That's sexual harassment in a workplace. Sure, right. it's a great day, if you don't mind carrying the constant weight of an entire corporation's success on your shoulders. Well, insult boss? Dreams. Be touchy. Oh, suddenly I feel like crawling into bed for a couple of months. Or forever. Thanks, Margot. 
When I was a little girl, I wanted to be a model when I grew up. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry, that... I just saw four women pick up copies of Supple at the newsstand on their way to work. It's already a fabulous day. Margot, you know, your ex-husband didn't make you bitter. He made you the female equivalent of battery acid. I suppose I should be all syrupy sweet like you are, Aaron. Yeah, I see how well that's working for you. Stay nasty. Oh, she got me. I'm melting. I'm melting. Aaron, did you dress for work this morning or for a walk? What? See, no, alright. Link me to where it's $2.99. Fuck this shit. Morning, Hugh. Looking awfully perky today. Feeling awfully perky, too. Must be the Java. Mmm, mmm. the <laughs> newsstands. Wait, Hugh. Let's gossip. You can even gossip on this game. It's great. The boss hates jeans. I know. Talk to me. Pay attention to me. Ew. <laughs> Why won't the cute boy at work talk to me? I saw the best documentary on the tree sloth last night. Wow. Yeah, I caught some of that. Then I watched some reality TV. They're surprisingly similar. What? I've got to get back to work. No! Fine, I'll work. Oh, I can switch the camera. Look at this. When you have to actually work. <laughs> Do research to find work answers. Find them before Hugh and Ernest Star. Stars are important. Coffee and snacks help. Oh my god. I feel like we're just typing random shit. Trying to look busy. Not actually doing anything. <gasps> what is he doing? Why is he getting up? Why is he coming over here? I'm working, Hugh. Talk to Hugh. Ignore Hugh. I'll talk to him. This work's boring. Have you ever met a more persuasive person than Margot? She could sell ice to Eskimos. You came here to talk about her boss in a nice way. Let's get real. Ha! Huh. Margo's about as persuasive as a vegetarian selling steak sauce. Trust me, Margo could convince a vegetarian to eat a steak. Go fuck yourself, Hugh. Bye bye. <gasps> stroke ego. Wait, I want to stroke your ego. <gasps> Is he going to snitch on me? That bitch is going to fucking snitch on me. Evil. Need more energy? All right, where's my energy? Hugh likes Aaron. Hugh desires Aaron. All right, we have desires, respects. Who needs that? Just get the desires. Boss <laughs> respects and likes. Wait, we can't have our boss desire us? Shit. My confidence is at an all-time low. Here's our aunt. All right, there's our energy. Aaron drunk. Aaron's anger. Hugh, you better not have fucking snitched on me. Move, Hugh. Aaron, I've been watching you, <gasps> and I'm thinking, she's so sweet, they ought to name a kid cereal after her. Be a bitch back at you. Oh, I want to be a bitch so bad, but I want him to fuck us. Man, I mean, does being a bitch really, I mean, in real life, I feel like he would still fuck us, but I don't know about the game. There's algorithms and shit to this. Thanks, Hugh. My goal in life is to have my name become synonymous with tooth decay and juvenile diabetes. On second thought, maybe they should just name a skin disease after you. <gasps> some new kind of wart. <gasps> See ya. What am I doing? I have to work. Yeah, why don't you get to fucking work instead of talking about me and children's cereal, you fucking weirdo? Holy shit. Damn. <laughs> The verbs are good in this game, actually. I'm... 10 out of 10 so far. Damn, he doesn't like us anymore. But he respects us. Look, we were a bitch. Now he respects us more. Say, All right, same. still the same desire. 
I like that. How much? I only got 25 energy for that? I'm literally gonna have to grind this shit out. Don't you fucking come over here, Hugh, and stalk some motherfucking shit. Keep walking, bitch boy. I can't even afford- Look at the courses! They're so expensive! We need a- How did you get so much money? Research equals instant cash. Game performance in green. Bonus cash. Okay. Race to the star. Aaron and Hugh compete for the pulsing star. Click OK, then mouse over star to see who is winning. Stars are important. All right, well, obviously, uh. <laughs> oh, look, my, my, my stats are going up. <gasps> Let's go suck up to Margo. Go suck up to Margo, quick, before Hugh can do it. Fuck you, Hugh. Oh, you look really good when you bend over, Margo. Hi, Margo. Hi, Aaron. Welcome to another fabulous day in single woman's paradise. My god, we're lucky. Oh, yeah. When I'm at home alone, I talk to myself constantly. Do you? Well, it feels like I talk to myself all day long at work, so why should home be any different? Whoa! Are you talking about me? Today isn't Saturday, Aaron. What's with the loungewear? Apologize, defend yourself. When I was bitchy to Hugh, he respected me more. Do you think she'll, I think if I defend myself, she'll actually respect me more. Well, we'll find out. I'm creating a new look. Corporate casual. Oh, Lord. Don't get creative, Aaron. Just be the lackey I pay you to be. Change <gasps> or get out. I guess... <laughs> I guess not. She's different than Hugh. Hugh likes when I'm a bitch. Now the boss didn't care for that. All right. Put some ecstasy in her coffee. Hell yeah. Let's insult. Oh, no, no, no. Suck up. Why can't I suck up? Here's a question for you. <gasps> what? What's Supple Magazine's slogan? Evade question answer. I'll answer. Our slogan is Supple <laughs> Women Have More Fun. How sad. And to think I had such hopes for your success here, Aaron. Damn. Fuck. <laughs> Their confidence level absolutely killed. Ah. Uh, can I suck up now? Oh god, she's ignoring me. Aaron's a- oh, I'm really fucking angry. Let me take it out. Oh, I can slap people too? I'm gonna insult Hugh. I need to take out my anger on someone. Hugh, stop working. Fuck. He's, oh God. Wait, he's going to win. He's almost at 100%. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm failing. Fuck. No, stop. Insult. Insult twice. What's the matter, Hugh? Couldn't get a job with the big boys, so you got stuck playing with the girls? <gasps> oh! Ha. I'm here to infuse a decent male perspective into this estrogen-saturated magazine. <laughs> Uh, hello. Supple is a woman's magazine, Hugh. If we needed a man's perspective, we'd rig a fake sex poll or something. Oh! <laughs> Stop mansplaining to us, Hugh. He really, he respects us when we're mean to him, so, alright. This is getting kinda hot. I like you, Hugh. I like you a lot. You don't like me. Oh, wait, shit, he lost our desire. <gasps> no. So, Hugh, what's it like having what? the IQ of a soap dish? <gasps> you tell I... me, Aaron. What is it like having the IQ of a soap dish? That's quite a comeback, Houston. I hope competing for that style editor position involves a battle of wits. Damn, the boss is staying for the drama. <laughs> She's had, like, 50 snacks. <laughs> she could stop. All right. I'm gonna Good have morning, Margo. How are you? Well, I just saw four women pick up copies of Supple at the newsstand on their way to work. It's already a fabulous day. I'm gonna get a snack. See you on the newsstands. Loser. Hey, Margo. Did you know I can count to ten in ten languages? Yes, 
And at every Christmas party, you treat me to a demonstration of this amazing skill of yours. <laughs> I'm such a loser! Anyone who includes your cat's names on her outgoing phone message needs to get a life, Aaron. <gasps> Whoa! Jesus Christ! Everyone's coming at me! Oh, this is not- where's HR? I need the, uh, this is a not a good workplace environment for me. Everyone's insulting me and being sexist. <laughs> oh my god. What's wrong with my cat? Everyone loves cats. I have a life, Hugh, and it involves my cats, okay? At least I have someone to come home to. Margot laughed at that. <laughs> Correction. You need to get a grip, then you need to get a life. Baby steps, Aaron. Okay. Fashion emergency question. You've just spilled red wine on your white shirt. What should you do? Red <laughs> wine on a white shirt? Pour club soda on it and dab. <laughs> Houston. Dab? I do believe my estimation of you Well, you know, dab, 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 but not Great dab. <laughs> Ciao. Dab no longer means dab. Damn, they roasted me hard. I'm just gonna go to work. I'm just gonna work my ass off because I'm getting fucking destroyed out here. <laughs> Shit. Dab on the haters. Fuck you, Hugh. I'm gonna dab on you. Dab on his dick. Hell yeah. He does the holy at least he respects me a great deal. These people have way too much caffeine though. Are we like look, she's like creeping on his ass as he walks back. Don't come near me, Hugh. Okay, good. It's like I need a binge eat before I go to work. Like I think that's what I actually need to do is just binge eat and drink. So I guess we'll uh, binge eat fruit. If America's Next Top Model taught us anything, we binge eat fruit. We're gonna binge drink caffeine. Go away, Hugh. <sighs> what? Aaron, you're an independent woman. You don't need any help being useless. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> holy shit. He just destroyed all women ever. <laughs> Damn. Oh, wow. <laughs> he just came over to say that to me. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm crying. You made me cry, you. Deflect and return insult. Oh, give it a rest, Hugh. You're so useless you'd have someone chew your food for you if you could. Flame. Gross. It's a good thing you're so independent, Aaron. I can't think of anyone who'd want to spend that much time with a weirdo like you. <gasps> oh! <gasps> Idiot. <gasps> All right, I'm binge drinking fucking... I'm gonna have lunch. It's forty dollars, but it better fucking be worth it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> we're yeah, we're being burned alive. The witch burnings have come back. Oh, go away from me, Hugh. Get away from me, you asshole. <laughs> All right, that actually got us a lot. I'm gonna. Oh, I was gonna have lunch again. I'll have carrot juice too. Vegan queen, Aaron. Spending all my money on food. Did he already get the third star? <sighs> Alright. I'm going hard. I'm ignoring him if he even comes over here to talk shit to me. We'll take this to a tiebreaker. Oh wait, we can. Here we got three stars. <laughs> oh shit. Wait, perks? 
perks earned so far. Ego and bitch. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> this game's savage. Ooh, we're getting this fucking star. Oh god, the boss. Please don't fucking destroy my life. Aaron, my dog Coco could do better work than you've been doing. God, why is everyone so mean to me? Everyone is so mean to me. Ouch, that's bad when your performance is compared to a Shih Tzu. Sorry, Margo, I'll work harder. Okay. Aaron X. Fashion emergency question. She doesn't You've respect just me anymore. Wine on your white shirt. What should you do? If they, all right, let's answer. Wait, is, are we gonna say the dab thing? What to do if you spill red wine on a white shirt? Mm, spill more on it and say it's a new design by Pucci. <laughs> Aaron, Aaron, Aaron. If you could only retain information like you retain water, you disappoint me so. Kate Marsh, Jesus Christ, this is so mean. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck you, I don't want to work here anymore. I've had it, Margo. <laughs> Fuck you. No, you didn't just slap me. Man, wow. <laughs> While I sort through how wrong that was, I'll tell you this much. She You're respects fired. me now. Oh. <laughs> I don't care, it was worth it. She told me I was retaining water. I don't fucking care. All right, new game. Hi, I'm Aaron. That was on easy? Oh, I'm being so fucking nice now. Hey, Aaron. Just you wait. Welcome I'm back to the grind. Yeah, exactly, Hugh, the fucking grind. Ignore. I've got to get back to work. See ya. All right, let him do his bullshit. We're winning. We are fucking winning. Yeah, like, he's in a tank top. He, she better have yelled at him, too, for looking like a slob at work. I'm getting two stars right away. Right away. Fuck him. I got all the energy in the world. Fuck you, Hugh. I'm getting this promotion. And then I'm fucking you. Look, he desires me, too. He sees what how hard of a worker I am. He goes so much faster than me. That's not fair. I'm getting money, though. All right, I'm getting money at least. I could buy a better outfit. Like, do I have to distract him and call him ugly? Like, how do I stop his ass? Because my shit is slow as fuck. I guess I don't have perks, but I don't... I like how work is in none of these. Maybe that's fashion. No, it's not. That's what I'm wearing. Yo, know, work is not any of the perks. <laughs> Buy a new outfit, maybe it'll work faster. I can't afford a new outfit yet. Oh, he's distracted. He's distracted. At 69%, he got distracted. Go, 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 go. Caught goofing off. Today's stupidest noise is... Are you ready? <laughs> Our boss just caught us doing that. Wonderful. Come on, you can do better than that, Costello. Better luck next time. I'm getting back to work. I'm getting back to work. No! Margo, distract him! <gasps> no! Fuck no! It's impossible. This makes Aaron angry because- Oh, he won that star. This makes Aaron angry since she worked hard to get it. <sighs> Oh, he's distracted. Go, go, go. Good morning, Hugh. Lovely day, isn't it? Lovely. Moving up fast now. It's gorgeous. Stupendous. Magnificent. Hang on, I'll get my Try guitars hard. and really tell you how I feel. I hope she Let's disses see him. if you can answer this question. What is the supple policy on casual Fridays? Trick question. There is no casual Friday at supple. Very good, Hugh. I guess some men do pay attention to women after all. 
Ladies. Stay supple. Are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> she may yell at him. She yelled at us when we were casual. He's totally casual right now. Oh, great. She's coming to yell at my ass. I know she's fucking coming to yell at my ass. Ignore. I'm working hard, bitch. What? Aaron, what are you wearing? In this office, there is no such <gasps> thing as casual Friday or casual any day. Sorry, Margo. I thought I was being trendy. Stupid me. I better go change. Stay supple. Oh, yeah, we just dropped that fucking line on her. Stay supple. Suck up. Hell yes. Let me get a latte. Oh, shit, no. I'm going back to work. Then I'll get a latte. I need more energy. You get so much energy. He's so good. Wait, while he's distracted. He's out of the room. Hurry. Go get the coffee. Go get the food. I'm gonna need to, like, literally read this shit to figure out how to stop you. No! Go Let's away! see if you can answer this question. <laughs> what was Supple Magazine's most popular article? Our most popular article? Um, single couples not exactly dating, but more than friends. Good job, Aaron. You warm the few cockles I have left in my heart. Whatever cockles are. Yes. I'm gonna get a cup of coffee. Oh my god, go, go, before Hugh comes back and works. We got the question right, though. And we got the boss's cockles. Hurry. Run. Run. Oh god, did he change? She didn't even yell at him. Now he looks good. Oh my god, fuck you, Hugh. I hope he dies in a fire. That I set. Oh yeah, distract him. Please distract him. Distract, distract. Hell yes. Any style editor should know the answer to this question. What is a shrug? A shrug is a shrunken sweater that covers the arms and upper back. Uh, for women only. Aaron is running out of steam. We'll work more slowly. Try to, time to try other activities. But I'm fine. Do I have to get drunk? You, I'm very Has he been getting drunk this entire time? Nerve. That's what helps him? So much better than me. Wait, it's he stopped. I wonder if it doesn't count him working if we're not there. God, I hope so. Let me get this quick beer and then we're going back to work. Oh God, he's moving up fast. I'm here drinking beers. Yeah, like pour it faster, asshole. <laughs> Kelly's drinking at work again. Oh no. <sighs> Damn, I should have saved the game. I should have saved the game when I got this first star. So I'll do that next time so I don't have to start over. I don't care. Margo's so bitter since her hubby Ryan left her. Margo's not bitter, Aaron. You're projecting. <gasps> I'm not bitter. Maybe I am projecting a little. If my husband left me to milk sacred cows in Calcutta, I'd be as bitter as a triple espresso. Hugh, I wish I could edit articles like you do. You are ruthless. Yeah, I like to consider myself the swashbuckling Errol Flynn of We editing. can lose, but at least she we can maybe get laid. Aaron. You remind me a little of my ex-boyfriend, the one I don't refer to as Pig Dog. What? You had an actual boyfriend, Aaron? Are you sure? Maybe he <gasps> was imaginary. <gasps> You're lucky I want to fuck you. So I'm going to keep flirting and ignore that little comment. He was real, all right. And that's just the kind of joke he would have made. Oh, Huey, you're so funny. <laughs> See you, sexy. Oh. <laughs> Do something besides talking to Hugh. Why? Can I, like, fuck with his computer? Where's he going? Wait. Make love? Do you see there was a make love option? Hold on, let me take these pills. And throw them on the ground. 
Oh shit, where is she going? Where is she? <gasps> where is he? Oh, he's getting clothes, huh? Oh, look at this very professional business wear. <gasps> you. Let's go to the bar, you. You, what's your favorite ice cream? That would be vanilla. Sorry, I can't be thrilling all the time. Oh. You, how's about a little drink at Buddha Bob's? Lead the way, little lady. <laughs> Hell yes, getting drinks with you. Hopefully we can fuck. Yeah, vanilla, what the fuck? Vanilla ass bitch. Time to corrupt him. Insult? I don't want to insult. I want to make love. Damn, we're not even drinking. We're just getting him boozed up. Oh, maybe I am drinking too. Okay. Look at him looking at us. He's thinking about it. Yeah, watch me drink. Could be your dick in my mouth. Aaron, you're not bright. You're luminous. And I looked that word up so I know what it means. <gasps> well, you just lit up my day, Hugh. Hugh, what's the craziest thing you've ever done on a dare? I took a job with an office full of women. Oh, women, so stupid. All right, flirt. All things in the universe are connected. Except it your cell phone while you're driving through a tunnel. Excuse me, please shut the Do fuck up. I'm trying to get laid. Street just to tell you how handsome you are. Not as often as you must stop traffic. You're a real uh -oh. babe. Ooh, oh my god. Uh you, if I were as good looking as you, I bet I wouldn't be single anymore. <laughs> Actually, Aaron, if you were as good looking as me, we'd be the hottest couple around. Oh. Congrats. The supple staff just voted you too gorgeous for any of us to sleep with. Well, then you must have been my running mate. Oh. Talking about hmm. sleeping with coworkers. Who is the stupidest person in the room. I vote Hugh. Whoa! Yeah, yeah, no. you're smart, and I'm a big drooling idiot. Got it. Can no, no, no. Game? Poke fun, not you. You have such a great body. Have you ever considered having your pecs bronzed? It's a flat out. Yeah, it How is a flat out guess? flirt battle. My bronzed pecs were going to be your Christmas present, Aaron. Oh. This guy's you enjoying the show. Had the most incredibly sexy dream about you last night. Oh. Let's get a drink after work and Dr. Hugh will analyze it for you. Ooh. Hugh, just out of curiosity, has any woman ever turned you down for a date? It happens, I get over it. Although I think I'd slip into a massive depression if you ever turned me down, Aaron. Oh, I wouldn't. <gasps> when do I get to do this? He's desiring me a lot. Wait, what? Stroke his ego. Oh, wait, are we getting more drinks or something? Oh, we're getting beers now. Oh, did he buy me some beer? I think he bought me some beer. Oh, he's getting me drunk. Oh, never mind. He only got himself a beer. Really? Just let me love you. Please. You, you're I'm so desperate. handsome. I can't look at you. It's like staring into the sun. Must be my sunny disposition. I saw the best documentary on the tree sloth last night. Damn, I can only criticize my boss? Yeah, I caught some of that. <gasps> then I watched some reality TV. This it's game turned from business similar. to just fucking quick. I know, because I'm gonna lose, so I might as I'm well fuck. No, don't leave me. No! At least, let's see if I talk shit about. No. No. Where'd he go? Get 
some espresso and an energy bar, and then we're laying down the flirting again. I'm getting laid. You know, we lost the game, whatever, fine. But I'm getting fucking laid. There is a cheap outfit. All right, I'm gonna, I was gonna look at all the outfits next game. It's just, which, I should actually do that, this one too, just so I know what the cheap outfit is, so I can do it as quick as possible. No, don't work, Hugh. Do you want our time to be cut short? That's how our time gets cut short, Hugh. Once, I chewed up an entire package of cheese puffs and then spit everything out into the air like I was a volcano. What? Can we just fuck? Instead of you fucking talking? I'm not allowed to talk to him anymore. God damn it. Aaron, Hugh, it's time for your performance reviews. Come oh, into God. my office. Fuck. Hugh, but you passed. It's a mystery. <laughs> Aaron, you just squeaked by, but you passed. Woo! Alright, actually, I guess I'm good. I'm good. Never mind. Alright, red get fired, green pass and bonus. Alright. I'm working fucking hard. I didn't realize. I thought I was just gonna lose. Howdy do, Miss Aaron. Don't talk to me. Actually, I'll be touchy. Howdy do, Miss Aaron? Are you channeling John Wayne or something? Why, I sure am, little lady. In fact, I think I'm gonna tug like the Duke all day. <laughs> oh my god. I'm grabbing a cup of Joe. I'm grabbing a cup of Joe. Don't fucking... I'm getting it first. Fuck you. Run, Aaron! Run to the carrots! Yeah, I'll get a new outfit, too. Need the new outfit. Just buy it. Actually, I like this one better. Shit. Aaron, you're as lovely as a field of dandelions. Leave me alone! I don't have time for your shit. Check you later, darling. Catch you later, baby. Excuse me. <laughs> All right, hurry, bye, bye. All right, how do I change? Click clothing icon at bottom of the screen. Closet will open. That wasn't work. Work, 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 work. I can take this course now. What is that? Wait, are those boots? Are those high sock? Oh, they're boots. Interesting. Education pays. Have Aaron take a course when she can afford it to swap or work more quickly to beat Hugh. I fucking better. Like, look how fast this shit goes up. Yeah. All right, ours is going up pretty fast too, though. But he doesn't get yelled at for his casual wear. It's so not fair. It's not fair at all. All right, Erin has invested in her career. All right, go, go, work, 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 girl. You need to fucking work. Go away, Hugh. Leave me the fuck alone. Ignore. Oh, yeah, we're moving now, bitch. Ignore his bitch ass. A little attention whore. Oh, I've got this. Oh, I think he's getting education, though. Come on. I don't care if it's slow right now. We're so close. Go away, Hugh. Go the fuck away, Hugh. Leave me alone. Yes! Oh god, it's so slow. I only need four more points. Let's stroke Hugh's ego now. Maybe we can- if we can- if we can go out for a drink with him right now, that would help our performance. Every woman feel like she's the only woman in the room. Look it's at our great. confidence. Women are such pushovers. <laughs> Excuse me. Women are such pushovers, Hugh. Hugh is such a fuckboy. Get nasty. But then he won't desire me. Are we pushovers? Maybe you're just too cute to turn down. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting back to work. Yeah. Oh, she got angry. Damn, I got fucking angry at him. I should have told his ass off. Why do we want to fuck him again? We're just trying to get a dicking. We don't really have any feelings for him. Just basically use him and abuse him. But no abuse. Just fucking. Now, last time I just went and got food. Like, you need to do all, like, all kinds of things, I think. Because last time I just got food and Always put that up again. Always listen to your inner oh, voice. 
even if you don't like what it has to say, or if it's just whiny and nasal and generally annoying. Thank you, I needed that. Could someone explain to me why the food that tastes oh, that's the best not helping. is always Get away the worst from here. for you? I mean, Fine. why Fine. can't we Go. live on German chocolate cake and french fries? Doesn't work. It's so unfair. <sighs> yell at him. You better fucking yell at him. Great, he's working. I'm, like, eating. I'm not enough for the next course. Hugh, I think if your brain were to make a noise, it would sound like this. Duh. <laughs> I would have hoped it would have sounded more like the Black Eyed Peas, but we can't have everything now, can we? Black Eyed Peas? Okay, I have a question for you. Where is the Boom Boom Room located? The Boom Boom Room is located on the 23rd floor. Why, Hugh, I'm impressed. Answers like that give me hope for mankind. Go, Aaron, go, Aaron, go, go. What, what, what? Oh, he changed real quick in front of her so he didn't get in trouble. Go, Aaron, go, Aaron. The boom, is it a boom boom room? Like where you, isn't that like a name for like se a sex room sort of thing? Margo, you're like the Mother Teresa <laughs> of single urban professional. Oh wait, boom boom room is black eyed peas. Oh, I didn't know that. I guess that makes you the Pope of pathetic single men. Mm. No, I mean you're like Mother Teresa because you're not getting none. Get it? None? <laughs> none? <laughs> Go, Aaron! Okay, I have a question for you. Who founded Supple Magazine? Oh god, we're going so slow! Janice K. Miller, a single woman warrior of the workforce, founded Supple right before she got married and handed everything over it's to you. It's too slow! Margo. I need a drink or something. You're right. You, I'm speechless. I need to do something Start. else. God bless vending machines. How? He's not even doing anything. How does my work performance go down? I've been working my ass off. Come to me, boss. Ask me a question. Or just ignore me. Oh my god. I'll talk to the- oh, I can't talk to the boss. I gotta work hard. Oh my god, no, I have to talk to her. Let's greet her at least. Margo, you are H-O-T hot today. <gasps> if I can be frank with you. He's making me jealous! Confront Hugh or Margo on their inappropriate actions. <gasps> I'd rather you stayed good, old, boring, predictable, annoying Hugh. Thank you very much. Let me- Confront him. Did I say you were hot? I meant cold. Frigid, actually. Whoa! As in my teeth are chattering and I'm layering the Bogner ski sweaters kind of cold. You're nuts if you think flirting with Margot is going to get you the style editor position, Hugh. I'm not flirting with Margot to get promoted, Aaron. I'm flirting with Margot to piss you off. Oh! Oh, well, uh, yeah, I knew what you were fucking doing. I knew you were trying to make me jealous first off, but maybe you shouldn't flirt with the fucking boss. Don't you have anything better to do, Hugh? I mean, take up knitting or something. Jeez. Forget this. I'm leaving. That didn't even help my game performance one bit. <laughs> it didn't help at all. Go away, Hugh. What? I'm only going to talk to you because I need other things. But you can wait. You know, Aaron, Marco is so miserable. I was thinking, I don't think I've ever seen her smile. How dare you talk to my boss about my boss like that? Now, Hugh, don't you remember? Marco smiled once the day Buddha Bob was giving out free daiquiris at the pub. Oh. Those daiquiris weren't free, Aaron. She told Buddha Bob she'd publish fashion don't pictures of him in the next issue of Supple if he didn't keep the drinks coming. Whoa. Don't talk to me. I have to work. See ya. Yeah, don't fucking talk to me. Come on, move the fuck up. Shit is so slow. 
What am I supposed to do? What can I do to speed that up? That's way too slow. We're going to lose. If I go to the bar, I lose work performance. He's probably going to gain work performance. Maybe if I flirt with him, it'll help. Hurry! Oh my god, you only got 7% done. Girl. You look so good. The more difficult the designer's name is to pronounce, the more expensive the garment. Wow. Hugh, if we were in high school together, I'd totally have a crush on you. And I'd totally ask you to the prom, Aaron, and we'd be voted cutest couple in our senior class. Cool. How come that helped his game performance? It hurt my game performance. I saw the best documentary on the tree sloth last night. The best? You mean there was a there competition? That's sad. That's a wholesome chat, and it worked. Should I confront? You know, Hugh, Marco responds better to talent than to the kind of blatant sucking up I saw you do. Oh shit, that didn't oh, help. You're just jealous. You're not skilled in the fine art of schmoozing. Yeah, well, when you schmooze, you lose. I suggest you learn how to do your job, Hugh. <gasps> Damn. Look at us, we're angry as fuck. And I gotta go back to the workplace. Moron. Whoa! That called him a fucking moron to his face. Alright, leave him there. Hopefully he keeps drinking. I can get more energy and then I am working hard. And I'm gonna win this promotion. Yeah, just shove that coffee down my throat. Oh, hello, boss. Oops, shit. Game. Aaron, your performance lately has been as pathetic as a high school production of Cats. Bitch, I have two stars. Yeesh, that's harsh. I'll work harder. At least I don't have to wear a funny costume, so there's that. I'm famished. I'm grabbing a snack. Aaron at Swimpy. Damn. That didn't help me. Oh, I hope he says something stupid to her. I'm gonna have a lot of energy after this, so this shit better move up fast. Hugh, I'm not a fan of my employees being drunk on the job. Oh! Oh, right. Me either. Drunk on the job? That's awful. We can oh, hear we can hear the sick. alcohol. We can smell I mean, the alcohol I mean, on your breath, Hugh. You. You smell the fucking oh, alcohol on your good. breath. Because I was so worried you didn't share my views. Go drink some coffee before you trip over your desk, Hugh. <laughs> Ciao. Later. He better move. His shit better go down fast. Leave me alone, Hugh. What do you want, boss? I'll work. Aaron, some people are ambitious. You? You're annoying, like a little gnat in my ear. <laughs> <gasps> Working my ass off! Deflect. Sorry, Margo. Sometimes I confuse ambition with just being a pest. Oh god, that didn't help. Hey, Aaron, what were you voted in your senior year of high school? Most likely to annoy? <sighs> Teaming up on me! How is this fair? They're teaming up on me. Ignore? Oh my god. If you must know, I was voted most individualistic. That's just a nice way of saying most freakish. <laughs> what Here's a question for you. What is Supple Magazine's slogan? I would love to answer you, Marco. But I'm in a very vulnerable place right now. Hold me. You're lucky you're cute, Hugh. 
I'm letting you off with a warning. What? I wouldn't have gotten a warning! Hey, Margo, hmm. did you know I can count to ten in that. ten languages? <sighs> yes, and at every Christmas party, you treat me to a demonstration of this amazing I can't win with the boss. She always fucking owns me. I've got to get back to work. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking lose now because my shit's all in the red because they fucking gangbanged me with insults. That was so unfair. <laughs> There's no way to win. This shit is hard. I guess I have to, like, just be a bitch. You, like, actually, I think you actually have to be a bitch. I'm not bitch enough. I need to work harder at that. Just... But then I felt like when I was a bitch to my boss, she just flat out fired you me. You catch me staring at your lips while we speak, Margo? It's only because your eyes drive me wild. Whoa. Speaking of wild, take a wild guess who's not going to be impressed by that pickup line. Aaron is jealous. Oh god, I'm still jealous. Hmm, let's see. Front him. Probably a colossally jaded woman like you, Margo, right? <laughs> Do I win the prize? What a waste. Whoa! If I talked like that to the boss, she would have fired me. Wow, Margo. You are one cold woman. Constantly gets to like not harass cold. her and then not get in challenged. trouble. Yeah. Cold. Like, I gotta wear a parka when you walk into the room. Brr. Leave her alone. You know, Hugh, flirting with the boss is considered sexual harassment. Oh! Get Not fucking the way told. I flirted, isn't. And who the heck are you to worry about it? <gasps> Stand firm. You know, we all share this space, and watching you drool all over Margot is just too sickening to ignore. What a jerk. <gasps> Call me a moron. I'm not the one sexually harassing the boss. <gasps> Fucking asshole. Can confront him again. <sighs> Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I need to just get to work. We're at 51%. He's going back to the bar. This is an alcoholic. I need to do this. I need to go hard. Margot makes six figures for doing nothing all day. Margot does do things all day. They're just too top secret for us to know about. Please, Aaron. Schmoozing ad execs and shopping in trendy boutiques isn't exactly classified information. That woman has it made. Bye-bye. Are you kidding me? I had such high hopes for you. You failed. I thought I would get that thing and my performance would go all the way up. 